Hello, everybody. Today, I'm going to show you how I turned this big thrifted men's shirt into this dress. That's today on Refashioning with Rachel. First, I drew a line a couple of inches below the shoulders. I curved the lines up slightly at the ends and cut that out. I cut off the bottom of the sleeves just above the button placket. And on the back of the shirt there was still a little bit of the yoke left, so I trimmed that off. I removed these extra buttons and sewed down the front button placket to keep it from flying open. I made a mark on the center back of the neck and on the shoulders. I cut a piece of elastic that fits snugly around my shoulders, plus a centimeter for seam allowance, and I sewed it together to make a loop. Then I divided the elastic into four equal sections, and I pinned the elastic to the right side of the dress lining up the markings on the elastic with the markings I made on the dress. And sewed the elastic to the dress. Stretching the elastic as I sewed, and using a zigzag stitch. Then, working on the wrong side of the dress, I folded the elastic over twice and sewed it in place using a zigzag stitch and stretching the elastic as I sewed. I made a narrow hem on the ends of the sleeves by folding over just a little bit twice and securing it with a straight stitch. On the wrong side of the sleeve, I drew a line three inches from the end of the sleeve and cut off a piece of elastic that fits snugly around my forearm, plus a centimeter for seam allowance. I cut two of these, one for each sleeve. And sewed them into a loop using a zigzag stitch.
I divided the line on the sleeve into four equal sections. And did the same on the elastic. And then I pinned the elastic to the sleeve, lining up all of the markings. And then I sewed the elastic to the sleeve using a zigzag stitch and stretching as I sewed. At this point, I tried on the dress and decided where I wanted my waist to be. And I drew a line at that point. And made a mark at the center back of that line. I cut out some elastic that fits snugly around my waist, plus a centimeter for seam allowance and sewed it into a loop and divided it into four equal sections and pinned it to the dress lining up the markings with the side seams and the center front and the center back. Then I sewed the elastic to the dress using a zigzag stitch and stretching the elastic as I sewed. And after the elastic was attached, this project was finished. So here's a reminder of how this shirt looked before. And this is how it looks now. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Please like and subscribe and comment if you did. And have a beautiful day.